स्टैंडर्ड फिफ्थ एनवायरमेंटल स्टडीज हाउ वी केम टू बी लेसन नंबर फाइव इवोल्यूशन ऑफ मैन काइंड फाइव पॉइंट वन फ्रॉम होमो हैबिलिस टू होमो सेपियंस सेपियंस फाइव पॉइंट टू होमो सेपियंस सेपियंस एंड सिविलाइजेशन चिल्ड्रन इन द लास्ट वीडियो we learn about the skill human and homo erectus now in this video we are going to learn about the neanderthal man and homo sapiens neanderthal man one more stage of development in human evolution is homo neanderthalensis he was physically big and strong he is commonly known as the neanderthal man because his remain were first found at neanderthal a place in germany his brain was more developed than that of homo erectus neanderthal primary lived in a caves they made tools out of big pebbles as well as from the flex scrap or from them such tools were fixed on a bone or wooden shaft to make weapons like the spear axe the neanderthals hunted big animals they used scrapers made from stone flex to scrap meat from the hide of a dead animals they used leather clothing they were mainly meat eaters they ate meat roasted on fire they knew the art of making fire by rubbing sticks of hard wood on each other or by striking one flint stone on another to obtain sparks neanderthals had developed some artistic skills some scientists believe that they also communicated with each other by producing grunts and other primary sounds however it is not known whether they had a developed language system to express their thoughts with the help of words when member of the group died the neanderthals buried tools horns along with the dead body also they applied red ochre to the dead body before burying it it indicates that the neanderthals had established some rituals of burying the dead in the course of time some groups of neanderthals left africa and migrated up to the continent of europe and asia naturally they had to face a different environment they had to adapt new ways of living and finding food therefore they went on modifying and improving the tools that were essential in their life however the improvements in the tools took place over thousands of years ago homo sapiens is the name used for humans that were more advanced than the neanderthals homo sapiens means intelligent or intellectual man we shall learn more about it the neanderthals and the homo sapiens were neighbors for some time in europe it is believed that due to a reason like their conflict with homo sapiens and inability to adapt to environmental changes the neanderthals became extinct on the basis of c14 dating it is estimated that the neanderthals became extinct about 30000 years ago the human species that was more intelligent than any of the earlier species was named homo sapiens 
in europe homo sapiens is also known as cro-magnon man their remains have been found in the continent of europe asia and africa homo sapiens made different kind of tools homo sapiens made different kind of tools and implements to suit the task they needed to do they used to make stone blades and fix them in grooves and notches made in wood or bone handles homo sapiens had evolved to the stage of having a fully developed larynx which could produce a range of sounds with subtle differences their jaws and the muscles inside the mouth were well developed and the tongue was flexible hence homo sapiens could use them to produce a variety of sounds and modulate his voice the way he liked using his imagination he could give names to the different thing he saw and could put his thoughts and feelings into words using these words he could speak and communicate in short he had a well developed language system he could draw pictures on the basis of actual observation as well as imagination he even began to make artistic object that is why he has been named homo sapiens intellectual man or thinking man 5.2 homo sapiens sapiens and civilization homo sapiens sapiens is the name given to the humans as their capacity to think developed even further than that of homo sapiens the capacity of their brain and their grasping power also developed further with time we the modern humans are homo sapiens sapiens the appearance and health characteristic of human beings indicate their similarity to their ancestors this is known as heredity genetics is a science that studies heredity genetic research has shown that we have inherited some traits of the neanderthal man thus it can be said that the neanderthal man and homo sapiens are both ancestor of the modern humans around 11000 to 10000 bc homo sapiens sapiens developed the technique of cultivating land and keeping animals because of their well developed capacity to think the speed at which they improved their technology increased with time they began to live a more settled life they began to grow food grain in the fields as a result the amount of carbohydrates in their food increased the changed lifestyle and diet affected the appearance of humans their body and face grew smaller than they had been in the earlier generations the name homo sapiens sapiens reflect their intellectual and cultural rather than their physical prowess all animals must necessarily meet their basic need for food however modern humans are not satisfied with only doing that much through their effort to enrich their life using their creativity intelligence and skills human being acquired a culture and continue to develop it the technological and cultural progress achieved by modern humans after the beginning of agriculture and domestication of animals has been extremely rapid the history of the evolution of humans that began from apes can be divided into various stages in the following lessons we shall learn about various facets of human culture of these different stages